Ooh, fire arrows. About time. Da -na -na -na. Hello guys and welcome to Let's Play Spot of Ocarina of Time Part 19 Yeah, I think it's part 19 Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 19 Okay guys, in this episode of Let's Play Spot of Ocarina of Time I, as you might have seen, have um, finally got the fire arrows after much effort But now I haven't got any arrows at all, so um, I'm gonna... Arrows aren't essential to what I'm doing next but arrows are, you know, kind of needed. Okay. Like I said in part 18, we are going to go to Kakariko Village because, well, I like Kakariko Village. I think it's a cool place. And let's destroy these bushes first. Ooh, arrows. Hard. Ooh. Rupees. Even though I don't particularly need them yet. Hey yo! Ooh, more magic. Bombs. Anyways, let's go to Kakariko Village, guys, because we like going to that place. Come on, Lake Ryan. What's holding you up? Go. Run, Lake. Run. Why are you so slow? God damn it, Link, run faster. Yes. Finally caught up there. Oh. I really don't want to be running all the way to Kakariko Village, so let's play a pony song. <laughs> Come on, let's get on a pony and let's get out of here. No, <laughs> let's get on. Finally. Well, we're off. Gallop, 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 gallop. Well, Kakariko is where we're going to end up next. That's where we're going. So, yeah, let's go to off. Let's get off to Kakariko Village, and yeah, pretty much it. Off to Kakariko Village. Oh, come on! You should have jumped over that. <sighs> Come on, this smack a pona. Spanking a pona. <laughs> uh, spank. Ooh, yeah, spanker, Link. What? Let's go enjoy the beautiful sights of Kakariko Village because I really like Kakariko Village. I, I think it's, it's I think it's an awesome place, and and yeah, above all, it's really good. Let's go. Ooh. Oh my god, what has happened to Kakariko Village? Oh my god. Link, what happened? Ganondorf better not have touched Kakariko Village. Link, do you know what happened? Oh, poor Kakariko Village. <gasps> it's Sheik. Hi, Sheik. Hey. Get back, take you in one. Whoa! What the? This came out of nowhere. Whoa, some invisible thing just came out. Whoa! Sheik, what's happening? Whoa! Oh man. Sheik, are you alright? Looks like some invisible thing. Show me what you got, invisible thing. Uh, Link? You can't see it, so I don't think it's a good idea to... No, Link, don't, don't! Mm. Uh, well, well, I do not want to see what's happening there. Well... Luckily the rain saved Kakariko Village. Thanks, Rain. We really appreciate that. 
Looks like you're coming around. I am? Taking only one. A terrible thing has happened. The evil shadow spirit has been released. Impa, the leader of the Kakariko village, has sealed the evil shadow spirit in the bottom of the well. But the force of the evil spirit got so strong, the seal of the well broke, and it escaped into the world. You mean that monster in the bottom of the well escaped? I believe Impa has gone to the Shadow Temple to seal it again, but she would be in great danger without any help. Let me guess, Shadow Temple is the next dungeon I gotta face to unlock another sage. So predictable. Anything with a different color text that has temple at the end of it, it's bound to be a dungeon in this game, okay guys? That's just to remind you. Take number one, Impa is one of the six sages. Destroy the evil Shadow Spirit and save Impa. <gasps> We're gonna be saving Impa because she's one of the six sages. There is an entrance to the Shadow Temple beneath the graveyard behind this village. The only thing I can do for you is teach you the melody that will lead you to the Shadow Temple. Gee, thanks. This melody will draw you into the infinite darkness that absorbs even time. Listen to this. Nocturne of Shadow! Wait, 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 wait. It absorbs even time? Huh? And how am I supposed to beat it if, it if it absorbs time? I won't get enough time to beat the... Never mind. You've got all the time in the world if to play this game. Do, 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 do. Never mind. Do, 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 do. Well, guys, listen to my most favourite song in the whole of Ocarina of Time. The favourite, you know, set my second most favourite song. This is my second most favourite song in the whole of Ocarina of Time. Nocturne of Shadow. Do, do. Classic. Absolutely classic. My most second favourite song. You've learned the Nocturne of Shadow. You'll find out my first most favourite song of Ocarina of Time in just a moment. In fact, you'll find out in the next couple of parts. But I'll, I'll tell you when, when we're about to hear my most favourite song of, of Ocarina of Time, okay? I'll, I'll tell you guys. And when we hear it, though. So, don't get too excited. Let me take care of the village. I'm counting on you taking one and one. Okay. Well, if you've got to go, go ahead and use a Deku now. Now that what you've done, you played the ocarina again, didn't you, Link? Oh, Link, I told you not to play the Song of Storms. Or was it the windmill guy? See? I told you the Song of Storms, even without the ocarina, had a use. I can listen to the windmill now. I can listen to the... I can hear the windmill now. I, I can hear the windmill now. Play the song now. There'd be no point, it's already raining. Listen. What? Have you ever played the Nocturne of Shadow that Sheik taught you? What do you think I just done? Just a minute ago. You annoying fairy. Ah Now normally no 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 Link, don't, don't you dare. Normally, um, it... Oh, jeez. Link, can't you just jump on the side of the well and not fall down? Normally, in this part of Ocarina of Time, we will have to go back into Kid Link and go down into the bottom of the well to retrieve the Eye of Truth. Thanks to me, though. You've already done that in one of the previous parts. When I had, you know, spare time, I got the Lens of Truth. as Kid Link in the bottom of the well. So, now... We don't really have to go become Kid Link. We can just play the Nocturne of Shadow straight away and go straight to the Shadow Temple. Because we've already got the Lens of Truth. Well guys, we're about to do our first dungeon. Wait, 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 wait. wait I need to prepare. Okay. Hmm. I should get more fairy bow. I should get more arrows. Well guys, let's go to the shop. Let's go to the Kakariko Village shop. And I'm gonna buy some arrows. That's better. What? It's still stormy. Ah well, I can still enter the shop. And it is day, so that means the shop will be open. That's a potion shop. I just pray this is a normal shop. Come on, be the normal shop. 
Wait a minute. It just froze. Oh man. Don't tell me the emu don't tell me the emulator's crashed. Oh man. Why now? I was just about to go into the shop and, 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 and do the thing. What? Oh, I hate this so much. I hate this so much. Well guys, the emulator has crashed for some unknown reason. Which means I'm going to have to be doing all that stuff all over again. But don't worry, I'm going to pause the video. And I'm going to unpause the video when, you know, I've done all that. Okay, so, be right back, guys. See ya. Okay, guys, I'm back. And I got full arrows whilst I was at it. Yeah, so let's see if I've got everything. Yep, got max everything. Got my stuff. And got almost all the songs, but don't worry, we're gonna, we're gonna get that last song later. Got a load of medallions, got maximum hearts, 19 sculptures. We're practically ready. Oh, and the lens of truth. Well, we've got that, haven't we? <laughs> Let's play the Nocturne of Shadow, guys. <laughs> Yes, yes, we want to warp to... As much as I love this song, I just want to warp to the graveyard. Come on. I can listen and enjoy the song later. Hey, wait a minute. I just noticed. Look, this is the symbol for the Sage of Shadow. <laughs> yeah, I just realized that. Don't know why, but I just realized it. This is where... This is where this emblem comes in handy. That's the fire emblem. Remember it? It has that fire thing on it. Anyways, we're supposed to use fire on all these torches. And this is where Din's fire comes in handy. Aren't you glad I got it? Well, you should be. Hooray! Now that we've lit all the torches... Enter. What do you want, Navi? You ever played? Yes, yes, I just played that a minute ago, you annoying fairy. There we go. Now that I've got the lens of truth handy. A shadow temple is quite an easy dungeon. It's not like the water temple, which is really hard. The shadow temple is, you know, pretty easy. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've got that. Yeah, yeah, we don't really need to do that stuff yet. We need to go through here and run around a bit and do some things. Going in the room of a thousand faces. Well, that's what I call it. See, they call it the Eye of Truth here, but really it's the Lens of Truth. Yes, yes, whatever, whatever. I can't bother to read them, I'll just go through them. <gasps> ah! Quick, play Sun Song! Playing this song not only makes it day or night, it also freezes Redeads and Gibdos. So we can beat them easily. Die, die, die. Although I would have killed them anyway. If I would have, you know, not used the use song. Hey, yeah! Yeah, that's right, you stand there and not do anything. That's what I want you to do. Hey, a chest! I think. Yeah, chest. Better use that chest. What's in these pots? Okay, boys, boys and girls. We're going to be getting the hover boots in this dungeon. This isn't the hover... These aren't... This isn't the hover boots in here. There's a dungeon map in here, but later on we're going to get the hover boots. Seriously, I'm, I'm being serious. We're going to get the hover boots soon. Don't, don't think I'm joking. We really are getting the hover boots very soon. Shadow Temple, Heroes Gather. Heroes Gather, the Hyrule's bloody history of greed and hatred. Whatever. You haven't seen Link's blood and hatred. What is hidden in the darkness? Tricks full of ill will. <laughs> that rhymes. If you can't see the way forward, what? Hey, what the? What the? Let's start with going this way. This place is really confusing. Seriously. 
Oh, another dead hand. I hate these things. Oh. Ah. Let go of me. <laughs> hey, guys. Remember the time when I went in the bottom of the dungeon with Kid Link and I tried to defeat this guy whilst eating Snickers? That was a very funny experience. Oh, just stop grabbing me for God's sakes. I just want to fight. I just want to fight this guy. Oh, look. It keeps grabbing me. What the hell? Stop. Jeez, they're grabbing me too much. I'm going to start calling you a lot of molesters because you're touching me so many times. Hey, y'all, y'all. Taste, say, taste the rub, might be gone, sword. Ah, let's use bombs on their asses. I can't be bothered. I don't care if it explodes on me. Quickly, get out of it. Snap out of it. Taste the rub, might be gone, sword. More wrong. You ain't going anywhere. Oops. Yeah. Oops. Okay, fine. Catch me. Whoa. Let's see how bombs affect it. Kablooey. Nope. Nothing. I didn't really do it properly. Yay. Now we should get the hover boots. Because dead hands are really hard and I always get good rewards out of defeating dead hands. So in there should be the hover boots. If there isn't any hover boots in there I'd be, you know, pretty pissed off. But there should be hover boots inside that chest. What did I tell you? There are hover boots. Mysterious boots you can hover on the ground. The downside? No traction. Which means no friction. If you ev you can even use these to walk for short periods where there's no slow ground. Be brave and trust in the boots. Okay. We're not going to wear them right now because, trust me, do not wear these boots at all times. Do not, because it's really annoying. You slip and slide everywhere and it's really irritating. Yes, yes, whatever. And also, the, the um, Lens of Truth use up magic power, so don't you know, use it obsessively. Yes, yes, whatever. I hate that annoying text in that room. It's so irritating. It's like Na'vi. Except you don't have an option to talk to her. It's like that annoying owl. Alright guys, this is the part where I use this. We look for the skull that is fake, and then make that thing point to it. In this case, that one. Oh wait, sorry. We look, we look for the real skull, and then we make it point to that one. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I know what to do. I've played this game before. I know what to do. So we don't point it to that one because that one's a fake skull. We point it to the next one because the next one is a real skull. According to the lens of truth. See? What did I tell you? Now we can't reach that platform by jumping. We've got to use our hard-earned hover boots. See, look. See what I mean by no friction? Yeah, I can keep them on because well, I'm going to keep them on because I can't be bothered to take them off. <laughs> Anyways, we should be going. There's nothing, you know, that much in this room apart from a gold sculpture and a few silver rupees. That's practically it. But I need rupees because I'm getting a tad low on rupees. Quick, no, Link, get down there. Ah. Oh. Ow, hey, how, how's I supposed to know that was going to come? That's it, I'm getting rid of these boots, they're so annoying. And I'm putting on the uh, long shot. No, 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 that's the ocarina, I'll always need that. Hey, yo. I don't really even need to use a shield, I can just duck. Like what Link's doing now. Yeah, that's particularly useful in this bit. Because you don't get hit by those things. Ow, ow. Yeah. Don't attempt to do that corner thing again. Good, it doesn't. Quick, Link, quick! Ah! Oh. Yes! It's just in time. And it's even harder when I do this because it's, uh, I'm on an emulator, so it's even harder. But, you know, couldn't be harder. You know, I've been playing this game for so long. And I've beaten it so many times. It gives me a challenge. 
I got a small key, this will be useful and later on in the dungeon. No, no, no! That was your fault, Link. Don't blame me for that, it was your fault. You're the one that decided to jump on that thing when I didn't want you to. Don't worry guys, we were supposed to go down there. Only to find out that a ship is waiting for us and we have practically got nothing to do, nothing else to do here, so we're off. I thought there would be a gold sculpture in that room, but it appears that there isn't. There's a gold sculpture in the place where that boat is, but... Sorry guys, no, not it. Sorry. No gold sculptures in this room. I thought there would be, but, you know, it turns out there isn't. No! I rolled to the door like a boss. I'm off, sorry. Gibdo! Kill the Gibdo! Oh, what? Help! He's humping me! Help! Help! He's humping me! Hey, you pervert, I'm gonna kill you! Pedophile! This is age 17, Link! I see, I'm playing this. Prepare to be frozen, Gibdo. Gibdo's never... Gibdo's never used to do that in, in the normal Ocarina of Time. Sorry, sorry, in the normal... Legend of Zelda. Looks like we're going to be needing some fairies. <laughs> the Gibdo is floating in midair. Thanks, fairy. Now let go of me, pervert. I'm going to do work for that one too. But this time we're going to be having more fun with this one. <laughs> this is a specimen. What should I use on it? <laughs> I know. Let's set it alight. <laughs> Let's test my new fire arrows on this on his ass. Hiya! Burn, baby, burn. Fine, I'll just kill him normally. Get off! Oh, you pervert! That's it. Prepare to be bombed. <laughs> Explode now! Boom! Yeah! Double who Because that's a big chest, there should be a compass inside that. Hmm. In a later version of Ocarina of Time, usually there'd be a fairy in this room, but turns out that there isn't. Ah well. I can survive without I can survive with only one fairy, I guess. I got the compass. Come on, I wanted the fairy. Or is that only in the later version of Ocarina of Time? Damn, why did I choose to play Ocarina of Time version 1.0 instead of version, I don't know, 1.1? We have to bomb this wall because, well, I guess we have to. To go, in, go further in the game, I guess. Okay, we should be getting close to where we want to go. Beware of sculptures, because they can come out at any time. And it's really annoying when you're just walking down the path, minding your own business, and all of a sudden, a sculptor comes down and knocks you on your back. Yeah, that's really annoying. So, just be careful not to bump into them. See? See what I mean? It's really annoying. Just walking down here, minding your business, and all of a sudden, a sculptor knocks you on your back. Just like I said. Just like I foretold. Beware of the guillotines. They can really hurt you. Are they called guillotines? I think they are. I think they're called guillotines, but what do I know? I'm just a kid. <laughs> That's what they said in Link's Awakening. Watch for the shadows of monsters that hang from the ceiling. Oh, you mean wall masters? I could use a few extra rupees. Yes, come down. I want to kill you. Hey, where'd you go? Yes, come down. I want to kill you. I get lots of rupees. Look at all the money it spouts out. Look. That boosted me up to 200 rupees. Now, it would be a good, I a good idea to use Pharaoh's Wind. Because I'm going to need to. What? What? There we go. We've made a warp point here. So... Uh, made a warp point over there where I 
uh, began, so... Oh! Yeah, like a boss! Yep! Whoa! Ah, quick! That thing! Yeah! Ow! Yeah! Yeah! Take that! <laughs> I wish I could use a shield with this sword, that would be really useful. Ah well, this is a very powerful sword, so I don't really blame Nintendo for, you know, giving it a disadvantage. It gives you more of a challenge in this game. Don't forget to use the hover boots for this. It would be really annoying if you went this far and all of a sudden you find out that you just fall down and then you have to return back to the beginning. What? You put Pharaoh's window over there? Why didn't you put Pharaoh's window all over to the other place? You know where I just began and... In fact, I'm not even going to loot. I'm not even going to wait for the sculpture to loot. Because I really can't be bothered. I'm so pissed off right now. Screw you, bloody sculpture Look, see? They're not, even, they're not even hard to beat. They just get in your way. So I, d I don't... I really, really don't know why Nintendo put those gold... Put those sculptures there. I mean, yeah, I, pr I appreciate gold sculptures, but normal sculptures, normal sculptures, they're, they're, they're not even hard, they're just really annoying. Like Na'vi. At least Na'vi doesn't repeat things when you fall down into things, like what she did just now. Yeah. I'm old. Okay, 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 let's, let's, let's fight. Hurry! Come on, I'm getting bored. In fact, I'm so bored that I even have time to put on my cockery boots just for this one particular fight. Finally, done something. Come on, sword again so I can fight you, so I can counter attack. Come on, hit me already. What are you, wimp? Yeah. He's dead. Meh, yeah, he deserved it. Let's put on the hover boots. And now let's pray that we don't fall down, you know, just behind the platform. <laughs> yeah! Like a boss! Whoop. Oh yes, I just made it. Whoa, 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 no, 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 stop! The thing is with these boots, of course, yeah, there's no friction, but it's just so slow also. It's really slow. You can barely get anywhere with these. Eat bomb. Ow. Damn, I've got one more fairy left. And I don't want to waste it now. Okay. Let's see how far we can get up to with this. Oh look, there's three chests in this room. This is a room worth doing. As long as there's fairies in this room, I don't mind doing this. Very fast. Oh, come on, you better have a fairy. Oh, give me a fairy. Fairies are essential. Gold Sculptula. Oh, it's just out of reach. Which means I'm forced to take out my um, hook shot. Or long shot to get it. Why can't I just never mind? Yay! Hey, chest! I got some arrows, which are practically useless to me because I don't really need them. Hmm. What, what do I do now? figure out what do I do from this point onwards hmm. what to do what to do ah I know see I've played this game before so I know what to expect come on push it over here link by the way if you use a lens of truth you'll be able to see the block I can't climb onto this block, so I've got to use it as a shield from those things. 
I'm going to take this block to the other side. Come on, push Link. Ooh, that was close. I should go to the back of it and pull it, because I might catch myself. Okay, that's good. How do I climb onto this? Oh, like that. I never realised I could do that. Oh, I'm going over here. Oh, what does this contain? You better have a small key. Oh, don't even need that. I've already got maximum rupees. That better have a small key in it. Trust me guys, it does have a small key in it. It does. Believe me, it's a small key. See? What did I tell you? I'm a boss at this game anyway, so... Oh, give me petty hearts, when really I need, um, fairies. But don't worry guys, because when I get to the boss, that's when I'm going to be using my fairies. That's when I'm going to go back to Kakariko Village and buy more fairies. Okay, when I get to the next room, something bad will happen. Hmm. What should I do from here? Oh, I know. Oh. What do I do from here? Ah, jump onto there. Yep. What do I do from here? Jump onto that? I guess. With the hover boots, of course, otherwise you won't make the jump. I've got, you know, magic to waste. I've got magic to burn, so... No, no, don't lag! Oop. Like a boss. Ah, we dead. Well, guys, it breaks me to say it, but it's the end of the part, people. Yep. But don't worry, guys, because next time in Let's Play a Spot of Ocarina of Time, we're going to be doing more Shadow Temple. We're going to have so much fun in the next part. We're going to find out, you know, if Link can defeat re deads without losing lives. We're going to see if we're going to die, which we probably aren't, but... We we we're gonna we're gonna see if we can beat the Shadow Temple without using up another fairy, which we won't because that's completely ludicrous. And pretty much continue on the fight. I'm um, sorry. Uh, pretty much continue on the Shadow Temple. So, see you in part 20. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe.